Martin, Archbishop of Canterbury, will be faithful and true. And faith and truth I will bear unto you, our Sovereign Lord, Defender of the Faith, and unto your heirs and successors, according to law. So help me God. Here now is the Prince of Wales. Prince I, William. William, Prince of Wales, pledge my loyalty to you, and faith and truth I will bear unto you, as your liege man of life and limb. So help me God. And then the homage of the people. And this is the invocation to anyone there and to the world, William, kissing his father with his left cheek. And this, a new part of the ceremony in which anyone who wishes to pledge their homage, their fealty, their loyalty to the king can do so. I now invite those who wish to offer their support to do so with a moment of private reflection by joining in saying, God save King Charles at the end, or for those with the words before them, to recite them in full. I swear that I will pay true allegiance to your majesty and to your heirs and successors according to law. So help me God. save the kings, but uh, perhaps there, uh, with the crowning and the homage being paid, is the, the one to listen into. We're then moving on after we listen to the anthem, and we'll check in with some of that, but the coronation of the queen then takes place, and of course, Camilla's been referenced as queen consort for so long, but she will then be the queen, uh, and there will be a ring presentation and a crowning, lots to us to discuss there as we move forward, but let's listen in a little more uh, to the anthem. 